What's going on everybody? It's the Bearded Shark and thank you for coming back and checking out my channel. If you're new to my channel, you know what to do. Press that subscribe button, press that notification button so you will be notified of new videos coming out in the future. Today we're going to be talking about a brand spanking new company, but wait, there's more. <laughs> that company is Norseman Beard Co. Norseman Beard Company, the owner, Terry, super nice guy, uh, met him through one of my subscribers, Jeremy. He uh, introduced us and he wanted me to try his products and see what I think about them. So I was like, sure, man, I'd love to try them out and tell you what I think. So he sent me out two, one of the oil and one of the balm, so a combo, and it's the set Tectana. So let me tell you guys a little about Terry. Terry has a very white, coarse, dry beard. So he wanted to try a product or come up with a product that's going to very well nourish and condition his beard because he found himself applying beard oil three or four times a day. So he wanted to see which carrier oils and essential oil blends that would work best for his beard so you don't have to apply beard oil or beard products in general so many times during the day. And if you guys don't remember, Dan C did make a video, which I'll put it in the description below as well, about how coarse or gray beard or white beards are a little bit harder to maintain moisture and conditioning rather than colored beards. And I noticed that too, because I do have a little bit of gray in my beard. So on that spots right there where there is gray or white hair, I do find them drying out a little bit more quicker than the other parts of my beard. But at least I have a beard. And of course, I'm not worried about the gray or the white. I embrace it. It's wisdom, or at least that's what people tell me. So let's get started. First of all, let's take a look at the ingredients that are enlisted inside the beard oil. Simple ingredients, 100% organic cold pressed sweet almond oil, jojoba oil, and castor oil. Just three ingredients, that's right. Those are the ingredients that Terry found that are best for his beard. So he included them in the beard oil. Now the scent, take a look at the scent profile. Teakwood, sweet orange, and forest pine. Sounds unique, right? So let's take a look at the oil itself. It does have a little bit of a slight of an orange tint and it is a lightweight oil, which you know, that's what I find works best for my beard is lightweight oils because of the fact that my beard just absorbs it better and it conditions it better for me myself. The scent profile with this, I get, I mean, you definitely get the sweet orange. The pine is a little bit towards the end and the teak wood is definitely up front. The scent that I get out of this, and I don't know if most of you guys remember this or not, but Tommy Hilfiger made an original cologne. Um, it was like in a little oval shaped bottle and then it had like Tommy Hilfiger right in the middle of it. That's the scent profile that I get out of this. It's definitely a cologne scented beard oil. I really do dig his uh, label too as well. Check out that Viking right there. Pretty neat. And the blue, I love the blue on yellow. And then of course right there on the side you have the name Tectana. That's the name of the, pro, uh, the, the scent that he sent me. The balm, the balm includes 100% organic shea butter, cocoa butter, beeswax, jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, and the scent, of course, is the same teak, sweet orange, and um, pine, fresh pine. And now take a look at the balm right there. I love the color of that. And this would definitely be a true, true medium, well, I would say it's flirting with the medium side uh, balm, but it's a true... It's a true light to medium hold, I guess you can say, but it, it, it absorbs very well in my beard and it, it, it's conditioned. My beard is long enough now for me to put a little bit of balm in it to keep it, you know, keep the sides from the flyaways from sticking out. It does definitely uh, emulsify quickly. So that's a, a plus right there. It's always good to find a balm that gives you a great hold but also it doesn't take an arm or a leg to, um, to emulsify. And if you guys see me sweating like a pig, I'm so sorry, my AC unit went out. So I'm just like, I live in a sauna right now. So, you know, it is what it is though. I don't know how they did it back in the, you know, 1800s or 1700s or you're Amish. I have no idea how you survive without AC. I would definitely fail at being Amish because I love, fat boys gotta have the AC, okay? 
<laughs> Overall, so let me tell you guys my experience with uh, Norseman. When I first received the products, um, it was literally the day when I trimmed my beard. And I started uh, testing them out and I was like, oh man, this stuff feels amazing. And then I tried another product and I was like, oh man, this stuff feels amazing. Tried another product. I'm like, oh man, this stuff feels amazing. And I realized, I was like, wait a minute, Mo. And I talked to my buddy Dan. Me and Dan talk on a daily basis. And I was like, man, every product that I try li literally like feels amazing in my beard. And he was like, do you think the fact that you trim your beard has anything to do with it? And uh, that is true. Um, after researching and all that, I realized, but well, whenever you trim your beard, you know, your kind of, your porosity change, and of course, the feel in beard also changes as well. So, when your beard is shorter, everything's going to feel a little bit more nice in your beard. So, I took a little break from Norseman, and I was like, you know what, I'm going to take a little break from this stuff because I want to see if it actually does feel good, or if it's just uh, because my beard is short. So, I started, you know, I tested it out for five days. And then I took a break from it and then I came back to it and then I started testing out it again. And I've got to say, this is one of the best feeling beard, beard oils that I've ever, that I've used to this date. Um, yes. And whoever lied to you and told you that you have to sacrifice, uh, scents for feeling, uh, feeling beard. No, you can have the best of both world, worlds. Um, you have to be careful how much, you know, uh, fragrance oils and essential oils you use because there is like a stopping point before it starts damaging your beard but um you can have the best best of both world worlds and you guys know that i love my beard to feel great and also smell great as well um so i highly 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 recommend you guys try norseman uh you know to me it did amazing wonders it made my beard feel amazing um, there's not a lot of products out there that I can say, oh my God, you know, I highly recommend they feel amazing. But this one really did do a good job in my beard. And I don't know, it's because, and don't be afraid because, you know, the, the ingredients in here are not designed only for people to have wider gray beards. Anybody can use them, but, you know, the ingredients that he did use are specific, specific ingredients that he, um, after researching and studying and and using and trial and error, found out that those are the best ingredients for his white coarse beard to keep it conditioned and moisturized. And we do have a giveaway. You guys know this already, man. So I'm gonna keep it sweet and short and simple. I'm gonna do one rule, one rule only. Um, this is just simply, I want you guys to go follow um, Norseman Beard Company on Instagram. And after you follow him, I want you to take a screenshot of it and send it to me direct message on Instagram. Today is July 5th. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run it until Friday, July 5th. I'm going to run it until Monday, July, we'll see, whatever the hell, July, whatever, whatever Monday is, I'll put, I'll put it in the, in the description below between now and Monday, 9 PM. I'm going to give you guys time to go follow him on Instagram. After you follow him on Instagram, I want you guys to take a picture of it and send it to me in my DMs. And literally what I'm going to do is I'm going to just, and if you guys message me with any kind of notes or anything like that after you screenshot it, sorry, it's going to be deleted because I want them all just, you know, paired together. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just literally record myself, just scrolling, find a random person click on it and i'm gonna double tap the double tap it to like it so if you guys screenshot me you don't see me liking it that's because i'm you know using it for the contest i'm gonna double tap it and like it and whoever i choose is going to be the winner of the uh of the giveaway from norseman beard company he also has a website that he just came out with so make sure that you go to his website he's got other um scents that he has this, this is the only one that i've tried is the tectana which I highly recommend. But that's all I got for you guys, folks. Um, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, dude. Or if you hate it, give me a thumbs down. But until next time, stay bearded. Duh.